want to turn to President Obama now, who's wrapping up his Gulf Coast vacation today. It was a trip designed to help promote tourism in the area. But the president cannot escape the controversy he created Friday night when he endorsed plans to build a mosque near Ground Zero. David Curley is traveling with the president and joins us from Panama City, Florida. Good morning, David. Good morning, Bianca. The president has another morning of rest and relaxation here. You know, we've had some thunder and lightning storms in just the past hour or so, and the president has basically walked into a storm of criticism over his comments over the mosque. It is the picture so many in the Gulf wanted to see, the president swimming in the water that until weeks ago was threatened by the oil spill. But the president's efforts to help the Gulf recover, being a tourist... Nice. Work Watching his daughter get a hole in one playing miniature golf. Are being overshadowed by his decision to jump into the debate about a prayer center near Ground Zero. Friday night he said Muslims have a right to build there. Saturday, a clarification. I was not commenting and I will not comment on the wisdom of making a decision uh, to put a mosque there. I was commenting very specifically on the right that people have. Uh, that dates back to our founding. That's what our country is about. Many thought that sounded like the president was backing down. The White House quickly issued a statement denying that, saying the president is not backing off in any way. It is not his role, they said, quote, to pass judgment on every local project. It is the local economy and the environment of the Gulf that the president wanted to focus on. And that's why I made a commitment in my visits here that I was going to stand with you, not just until the well was closed, not just until the oil was cleaned up, but until you have fully recovered from the damage that's been done. We also want to keep our focus here. Meeting with business and political leaders here, the president promised that even with a well cap, he will stay on top of the cleanup and make sure BP does what it's promised. And he gave his best tourism pitch. To Americans all across the country, come on down and visit. But that message may get lost now that the president is fully engaged. Both feed into this debate about whether or not a mosque or prayer center should be built near Ground Zero. Expected to dominate the political debate today and the days to come.